What's the answer? Don't, don't, don't do that. Don't. So, how do you do it? <clears throat> how many le three-letter words are there that contain the letter A three times? One. Okay. Very nice. A, A, A. Okay? There's one of those. How many three-letter words are there that contain the letter A twice? So I can have so a, three, I a blank, right? A blank A. Bla a, a blank A A. Okay. I forgot one. A blank A. So how many possibilities are there? How many possibilities? Three. Three? I can think of a lot more than three. Oh, times 26. Be careful. I can do A A B A A C A A D A A E so, and so on. There's twenty five plus twenty five uh -huh. plus twenty five. Okay. Um and then what? We've got uh A blank blank, uh blank A blank and blank blank A. Mm -hmm. Twenty five times 25. Ah, 25 squared. 25 squared, 25 squared. 25 squared. Like 25 squared, like 425 or something? 25 squared is how many quarters does, uh, how many dollars does 24 quarters make? 25 or 24? 24. How many dollars? Um, Divide by four. Six. Six. So if I add one more twenty-five, I get six twenty-five. So twenty-five six quarters four. is six dollars and twenty-five cents. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Um. Okay. So what do we know? Uh, what is it? One plus three times twenty-five plus three times twenty-five squared. Uh, I just want to show you what's the super easy way to do this. Okay. How many of the words contain no A's? Uh, none. Really? Uh, yeah. They had B, C, D. No, I'm talking about, oh, just of all the words. Of all the words possible, how many of them contain oh. no A's? 25 times 25 times 25. Aha. Uh -huh. um, so the total words minus words with no A's um, should equal words with, with at least... One A. Um, there's a little trick. You can always do this. When you see something that says at least, mm -hmm. it's usually easiest to actually count the total and subtract. Okay. In other words, um, whatever this thing is uh, should be the same as 26 cubed minus 25 cubed. Okay. Okay, and there's actually a very easy way to see that. Um, do you know what, uh, do you know how to do 1 plus x cubed? Yeah. Yeah? How, 1 plus it? x times 1 plus x times 1 plus x. Okay, so. And they do foil too, and they do foil. So you can, foil. so you, here, we'll do this. Uh, you can pause the video and foil it out, but I'm just going to show you what it is. 1 plus x cubed is 1 plus uh, 3x plus 3x squared plus x cubed. It's in table shaking. Oh. So uh, 1 plus x cubed is 1 plus 3x plus 3x squared plus x cubed. 
And if I subtract off x cubed, mm -hmm. um, this turns out to be 1 plus 3x plus 3x squared. And notice that 26 minus 25, I can just take x equal to 25. Okay. Right? And look at this. That's exactly what we got up here. Yeah. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. Okay. So this should be the same as 1 plus 3 times 25 plus 3 times 25 squared because all I'm doing is I'm foiling this out and subtracting this cube. Anyway, you can figure out the number. Well, we can probably figure out the number. Uh, what's the easy way to do it? What's 3 times 25 squared? Uh, 3 times... Is the 3 also getting squared? Hmm? Is the 3 also getting squared? No, it's not. So we could factor, we could do this. Um, I'm trying to think if there's an easy way. No, I can't think of it. So this is uh, 1 plus 76. No, not 1 plus 76. 76 plus uh, 625 times 3. Uh, 76 plus 1875? Yeah. Not 19. Yes, 19. 1951? Mm -hmm. Is that right? I think so. Fingers crossed. Otherwise, I don't know what I'm doing. So they do it. I just saw it. Oh, you did? Yeah. I okay. think. 1951. Okay, so case three... Um, so, I'm just looking at how they, they do that. <clears throat> yeah, they do exactly the same way. Okay, great. But remember the key word when you say, <coughs> when you see at least, okay. you should possibly think about this other way of subtracting. Okay. Okay? Uh.